Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another RMA Fire tutorial. This is a really quick tip, but heck, this tip helped me so much. Like, it's crazy. So, how do we delete points or kill particles on flip by age? Um, for the longest time, I've always used P skill, so just exporting the age of the particles and then scaling those particles down by age or scaling them down when I mesh the geometry. Um, don't get me wrong, I still do this, but this is a good tip to have if you want to control um, flip particles by age. So let's go ahead and set up a, a quick flip setup. We have a sphere, we're going to do a top a um, flip source. Do a dot network. Drop down a null. And we're going to say this is outsource. And inside of dobs, we're going to do a uh, flip object. Flip solver. And connect these two together. And on our flip object, we will select our source, make that particles, and on our guides, make this particles as well. And last, I'm going to copy my particle separation here and paste it on my flip source particle separation. Uh, paste relative reference so that I can control that inside here. And let's add a gravity to it. And now we're going to do a flip source volume source and this is gonna be our source flip and outsource and let's go ahead and play so as you know now this is going to like play forever the particles never die in this kind of flip fluid but here's the catch if you come into the volume source you go to particles you give them life expectancy and let's put like a point let's give it a one and point five basically this is gonna work the same way as pops and then on our flip we're gonna come here and we're gonna say add an id and add age just because i like to add those but the trick is reap particles all right so now if we hit play you will see that i probably made them they're dying but Let's just make this more obvious, like 0.5 and 0.1. And look at that. Simple, quick, but ultra important trick. This is how you go about controlling the age of flip fluids the same way as you control them with pops. Give me a like if you guys liked it and I'll be back with more.